The lady with the red jumper, I can't see your face. Yeah. That's cool. We all in now. Yeah, you're all in. to the seafood evening. Thank you. Enjoy your meal. Hi, um, from Wigstein Seafood Restaurant, Wigstein um, um, in Pasto. Uh, my name is Stéphane Delourme, I'm from Brittany, and I've been working for Wig for 13 years at the HF at the Seafood. Um, tonight we're going to do a special seafood evening for uh, San Morgan preschool and um, and uh, on the menu tonight we will have mainly fresh Cornish Cornish products we've got lovely lobster salad so we're doing a lobster salad with spring um, veg and um, and a Roger special dressing and uh, and after that we've got a fish pie fish pie made with prawn crab uh, scallops monkfish and um, and we will serve that at this fish pie with uh, fine beans, carrots, a melange of fine beans, carrots, shallots, and uh, some Cornish new potato cooked with mint and parsley. And um, after that, we will have um, Monsieur Stuart Pate done a strawberry tart, nice strawberry tart um, with Cornish, Cornish strawberries. So what, sorry? You were salmon. Did they? Did they? She loves me. <laughs> she loves me not. Uh, my name's Stuart. I'm volunteering this evening. I own the Dal Swinton House Hotel in St. Morgan. My name's Stuart Pate, um, I work at Rick Stein, so I'm his pastry chef, and I'm helping Stefan um, with this function tonight um, for charity, and I'm doing the dessert, which is a strawberry tart, which is uh, 
using the hand-picked strawberries that the guys have picked for the dessert and that's going into a pastry case which has got a pastry cream in the bottom the strawberries and then it's glazed with Roger's strawberry jam we're doing a compote of summer berries with strawberry coulis and we're going to go round the plate with the strawberry coulis that Roger's made and then we're going to finish it off with a vanilla ice cream quite a challenging evening um, space is quite tight but um, it all works out in the end and um, it's just a question of you know, pulling together and uh, working as a team. guys <laughs> I would like to thank people who uh, helped with the evening tonight especially Roger and Jean Stuart who have uh, done all the pastry with me Stuart Pate um, Neil Chamberlain Stuart Hope uh, of course uh, Peter McGann who have done a big 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 job to organize all the evening I'm sure I forget a lot of people but all the suppliers who give us all this, this lovely food or, or, or um, help us to, to, um, to organize this uh, special evening. Do you remember last October how all this first started? Yeah, we were just chatting, and it was it was there were three things we were looking at because we were looking at this stuff, which is my favourite, you know. So uh, and then obviously Roger's Roger's strawberry jam and Roger's yellow stuff, and we were saying, how could we get this into some decent um, into some decent food? And so we into uh, so we thought, wait a minute, right? There's three things we can do here. We can we can actually put a, a, a really good uh, event together to pull the community get together. We can bring Rick Stein's head chef, Stefan, in, and he can cook for the whole community. And we can raise some money for, for three charities mm. as well. So amazing to think that what we got at the end of it came out of just that little conversation. Yes. There. Yeah, casual conversation in the kitchen. Amazing. It worked really well, encouraging lots of people to come and help. It was fantastic. Mm. Yeah. What a real community, community yeah. spirit. Yeah. Absolutely wonderful. Stunning village community. Absolutely mm -hmm. brilliant. Unbelievable to think what came out of it though, you know, so yeah. everything kicked in with every single person mm -hmm. to, you know, put them together. Yeah. Whether it's the chefs, and in the nicest way, Stefan isn't from here, nor is Stuart, mm. but for them to come in and help the community was amazing. Yeah, eh? yeah it's very Three generous. Guys. Very and then generous. Neil and Stuart. And, and all, all the girls, Stuart. definitely. Yeah. All the girls, they did yeah. the most fantastic job. And John Lewis. Oh, of course, Lewis. Lewis. He was superb. And Celine came in from Manning, oh. she well, was superb as well. She was the sort of um, the master class for the rest of the girls, <laughs> yes, wasn't she? Yes, she she was. really ordered them and served them, made them go around properly mm. in a professional mm. and sold billions of raffle tickets. Yes. I am not leaving this table until they're all gone. <laughs> <laughs> and um, <laughs> what's uh, Julie? Julie selling the, uh, oh, it's Julie doing the raffle in the evening, eh? What entertainment? <laughs> for some, for some, yeah. It's their fun. <laughs> and as for the money, raised at the end, uh, what do you think? Three thousand one hundred and seventy-two pounds and forty p. Roughly. No, exactly. <laughs> net, net, <laughs> net, 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 net. Yeah. And that's what's going to the charities. Yeah. Mm. Uh, and I think they're going to be well pleased with the fundraising event. They will, yeah. Oh, I'm sure. And you know we're sitting here, obviously at the back of the post office, and you can hear the kids across the road. And I just stood right. on the wall just to look in to see them, you know. Mm. And I thought, isn't that fantastic? Because of what they received. You know, mm. So, but then they they give plenty as well because they did the decor. Yes, 
Oh, yes, they helped yeah. with all that. They the did paintings. Painting yeah. the flags and things, didn't they? The Absolutely an incredible evening. Yeah. And I think it's one that will be remembered by those that attended oh, for a yes. long, long time. And we're well, sober enough to remember the end of it. And yeah. those that weren't here will remember it as well. <laughs> Oh, absolutely, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>